Alright, let's see here. Necrophage oil. Let's do this. You know I'm a nerd that watches anime and whatnot? What's that video thing on, boss? Nothing wrong with anime. At all. And it doesn't, does it affect the game at all? Well, yeah, I, see, I can change the DPS on my mouse, which I've already done for this game. So, I mean, I get direct input regardless. Like, if you guys look at my mouse, I don't know if you can see it really. I have this button here. If you see these two bars there, I have them set so I can run 3,000 DPI, six, uh, no, yeah, I think it's like 800 DPI, and then I can turn it down to like 350. So, yeah, I can change my mouse any way I want. Stream talking so much, can't watch right now for some reason. Uh, tell them to turn it off a source, actually. I don't even know if I have enough viewers for quality settings right now, but don't put it on source. Source means you're watching as, like, the actual bitrate I'm streaming it. Turn it down from source and you should be able to see it better. Dragon's root. Wonder if it can really but on like and see the future. low or something. Oh, okay, right on country. Yeah, like I said, I, this any other game I've ever played it's always been suggested to turn hardware cursor off. Uh, mainly because it fucks with mods, but also that it causes an FPS dip. I don't know, because it makes the computer work harder to render, I don't know, something. I've just always read that it was bad for me to use, so I'd never use it in games. I just always default to turning that off. However, I am willing to give it a try. I'll just do it off stream and kind of experiment a bit, you know? But definitely check it out. But yeah, I'm a boss. Yeah, you definitely don't want If you're having lag issues, if you're having buffering issues, putting it on source does not fix it. It usually makes it worse, because the only time you could you should ever be lagging watching my stream, because I've turned down my bitrate a lot to accommodate for people with slower internet than I, is if Slow now. you uh, are downloading something while watching the stream. That's the only time you should ever lag. Um, other than that, it's your internet. Turn it down from source if you have quality options. Put it on, like, low or mobile, and then you should be fine. Source is going to get the video exactly as I'm streaming it. And if your computer already can't handle that, putting it on source just screws you. Because it should default to source, actually. Source is higher than high on uh, Twitch settings. Alright, let's see what we got here. Go back. Uh, yep. Yeah. Here you just asked for. Got what you asked for. Thingy. Now I need a moment. Yeah, you normally don't get it, Freka, until I have, like, over 30 viewers. Once I have over 30 viewers, it pops up, normally. 30 to 50 viewers. I see a wolf striving forward towards a solitary tower midst a blizzard. He follows the swallow, yet the swallow does not heed the wolf's howls, soaring higher and higher, for it knows tis its last flight. As do others say, so shall it be. Look for the signs. The world will perish amidst ice. And be reborn with the new son. Reborn of the elder blood of Henniker of a blunted seed. If means prophecy. Leave me be. Go. Go now. Look for the signs. Let's complete it. Right. 
Parents receive Fede. Play Gwent. Oh, you're back. Hey, what's up, Ninja Pony? Let's play Gwent. Another round? Sure. Only diversion we get in this wasteland. Let's lay him out. Okay, I need to play more weather. I don't need the impenetrable fog, so I've actually got everything I need on this, I think. Yep. Let's play. What do I get in my hand? Keep the frost, keep the rain. I think I'll burn Yarpin. Cool, and I'll burn a Ballista. Perfect, okay. Two frosts actually works really well for me, to tell you the truth. I might actually win this round. Because he'll pull a crazy amount of fucking cards out. Yep. Alright. Question is, should I run the horn on ranged or melee? See, melee I'll get 9 points plus the horn. Well, oh, because I get 9 points regardless. Excuse me. Very cool, Psycho Prism. Awesome, man. Hey, good job, Ninja Pony. Thanks, buddy. I appreciate that. Wifey agrees with you. All right. Hmm. I guess I'll play Sabrina Glezevig right now. That is Sabrina, right? Yeah, Sabrina Glezevig. Perfect. I'll hang on to that then. I'm actually pretty glad he played that. Let's go with... There we go. No, he's not. If he pooped while he's at work, he gets paid for it, technically. Like, I do that all the time at work. Sweet. There we go. Play those cards, bitch. Uh, question is... So I know I should hang on to that rain card. Should I play a frost now? Because I'm thinking I should. What do you think, Freka? Should I go ahead and play one of the Frost now? Because it'll make him pull out his uh, Siege cards, and I'll let him win this round. That way I can keep my Rain and another Frost for the next round. From what I've noticed about this guy's deck, he doesn't have hardly any range cards at all. It's all Siege and Melee, which I can kill with the Rain and Frost. And I can save the Horn for when I run my Trebuchets. No! Actually, I can run the Horn on... I can probably run the horn now, actually. And then run Frost. I'll wait, I'll wait on you, Freka, because I know you're better at Gwent than I am, so I'm actually I'm really curious. Like, I want to beat this guy. Play the Frost. Alright. He's passed. Now I could win this round right now by playing my trebuchet. <sighs> or should I let him have this round? Fold or trebuchet, Freka? Because I'm not going to pull a card yet. I haven't, you know, I don't have any discard. Or I could actually play the horn and just boost one of these cards and keep my number cards. That could actually work too. But I don't want to waste that horn though, because I could totally roll that the next round, just give me extra points. But it would be an easy discard on this one too and pull the win. No, actually, no, it wouldn't pull the win either. That'd be a waste. Okay, I'll play the trebuchet. Good point. 
Good point, Freka. I like it. So he keeps that card on deck. Alright, let's see what he's got here. Awesome! There we go. Thanks, Mr. Pony. I appreciate that, buddy. You're a good man. <laughs> nice. Well, let me get in better shape first. I still got these, these chubby cheeks I'm dealing with. Now, I've lost about, I don't know, 10, 15 pounds in the past couple months, but I'm working on it. Yeah, yeah, that's, that's true, Freka. That's very true. I can definitely revive the trebuchet. So he's already run Scorch, which actually helps me pretty well. That actually helps me really well, him running Scorch already. That's gonna pull three cards. Boom! Look at there. I'm okay with that. Alright, there we go. Oh, if you're straight man. Yeah, he am. He am. Wow. I'm a reread. Oh yeah, that frost is gonna be beautiful on this. The crush makes it doubtful. I don't know. I don't judge. I think a man giving me a compliment, gay, straight, bi, whatever, is weighs equally if not higher than a woman giving me a compliment, to tell you the truth. Hey, Crazy Panda Man, thank you so much, buddy. That's really kick-ass of you. I appreciate your support. Uh, how was my Memorial Day weekend? Dude, it was fucking awesome. Like, I had a great weekend. Uh, wifey's friend came over. We got to spend some time at the beach. Uh, we went to Crab Island in Destin. You guys should look it up. It's a really big sandbar in Destin, Florida. Awesome place. Or check my Twitter. I'll put a picture up. It was beautiful this weekend. Um, so I had a great weekend there. We, we spent Saturday there. Sunday, we hung out at the house. and went out to eat at a great place. And then Monday, I streamed for like 10 hours almost. Great day Monday. So, I got you got a good stream in on Sunday, too. I don't know, it's just a really good weekend, actually. It wasn't long enough, as usual, but it was pretty good. That's true. I think Ninja and I could be good friends. Well, kind of, sort of. I mean, now that you're 21, we definitely could be. I have such a strong, defined jawline. I must look a lot better on the fucking camera. The full disability I have, Freka, is a boost... To, it, it's a free horn for my siege weapons. So I'm debating on what to play. That's why I'm like not wanting to play my rain card yet. I want to see if he plays any siege weapon cards. So I think I'm going to bait him into using his last card by boosting my melee. So I'll kill everything he's got right here. There we go. That should pull out his trebuchet card. Boom! So, with that being said, now I'll run Frost, kill all of his points. Opponent's passed. So I should pull this out now. So I've got 12 points. I can run six and win. Wait for it. And boom! The win is mine. So that, that's the biggest thing, Frick. I didn't know if he had a, uh, a fog card, which he played last. So I went ahead and played it on the melee, even though I knew I was going to freeze the melee, because it still would give me more points after I killed him. And then I can keep my frost good, or keep my uh, ranged good, and see if he played that. Yeah. That's what I was waiting on. Because he can use his full test and run a, far, a, uh, a fog from the full test that he had. But I win now, so we're golden. Booyah! So is the soothsayer's lot. I know where to find the finest slippery jacks this fall. But how to play and not lose, that I'll never know. A beautiful win.